The one going up the arm is Love You. That actually is like from a card uh, that my mom wrote to me that I found right after she passed. That's her handwriting. Tattoos. One of the ways the Van Stratton family remembers Jima Van Stratton, who passed away last summer after a courageous battle with brain cancer. Another way they remember and honor her, the second annual Redbird Ribbon Walk. At the end of the day, we know we're doing something positive to help others. And that's really what this is about, knowing that how many families are going to benefit from what we're doing today. Jama's husband, Dan Van Stratton, organized the walk. All proceeds go to a De Pere High School group that does projects throughout the school year to help families fighting cancer. Everybody's affected by cancer, so be there for those who are and just help them any way you can. This year, a special guest leads the walkers. His scans are clear and he's looking good. So we are very thrilled, Easton. So I wanted him to be our Grand Marshal today. Oh uh, yeah, I was really happy. I feel honored to be here. I think this inspires others. 11-year-old Easton Hauser had been battling a brain tumor, and last year he had lost function in one side of his body. His dad says that Easton's brain tumor is gone and that he's doing much better. So, like, one of my main words from the hospital was uh, determination. Just know that, like, stay determined that you can do this. Van Stratton said that everybody at the event on Sunday has been touched by cancer in one way or another. In addition to raising money, the event brings families who are all in a similar situation together to spread messages of hope and positivity. Don't lose hope. You know, hope is the one thing that no one can take away. In De Pere, Paul Stino, Local 5 News.